G'day Ziggy D here and prepare yourself to embark upon an epic adventure in space with my first playthrough of Faster Than Light. This game is a game that I've played briefly before, but uh, I'm for all intents and purposes a massive noob. Well, at least I was when I first started this playthrough, but this was absolutely epic. I had an absolute blast doing this, and hopefully you guys should uh, have, this, have a similar experience actually watching it as well. So Faster Than Light is a space roguelike with some strategic elements thrown in. Instead of having like a, a character like you would in a roguelike, an RPG character that you play, you instead uh, manage the crew and a ship that is escaping from a rebel uh, pursuing fleet with important data that you have to take to your, your commanders on the other side of the universe sort of thing. And uh, you basically jump from system to system trying to evade your pursuers and evade all sorts of other uh, interesting scenarios and trying to make the best of things while you upgrade your ship, uh, hire new crew members and uh, try not to get exploded. But uh, this game is a blast guys, it has some really cool like narrative elements that come out of it, sort of like this emergent gameplay, and uh, you know, when you start naming your characters and they start developing these little backstories and stuff like that, it gets pretty exciting. But uh, that's enough talking it up, you guys should just dive into it, you know, chill out, get a drink, maybe get some popcorn or something like that, and uh, enjoy. I'll be putting up a few episodes of this game, so uh, that's it for now. I'm Ziggy D, and thanks for watching. New game, I'm nervous. <sighs> okay, so we have currently only the one ship. You unlock additional ships later on. So uh, this is the ship list. Here you can just select a summary of your ships. There are some changes to the original style. To unlock a new ship, you have two options. Find and complete the unique quest within the game world. These will often start as homeworld sectors. Alternatively, beat the game with the previous ship and list. Unlock the next. So I only have this one ship at the moment. Uh, I believe there are, are they different? United Federation. Full Arsenal, Kestrel, Cruiser Victory. Are these like, those must be achievements for it or something. But you can select different layouts that you can unlock and stuff as well in addition to that. A terrible spot really? Uh, what would be a good spot for the camera do you reckon, guys? Faster Light has uh, rather limited real estate for a stream. Uh, okay, alrighty. Well, we'll see how we go. Should I play on easy, normal, or hard, guys? There's easy or normal or hard options here. Increased scrap rewards and easier enemy generation. Standard scrap rewards, your score gets 25% boost and hard. I'm probably not hard. I think I should probably start on easy, guys. I'm, I'm terrible at this game. I'm a noob. Alright, so we need customization. Uh, let's go rename Zigger Day. Oh, yeah. There we go, accept. New systems, weapons, alien race, and more recommended for experienced players. Well, well, YOLO enable. YOLO enable. Easy is pretty hard as well, especially when I'm a noob. All right, let me let me pick some names out of chat for our, for our guys here. Rename. We have Bob Griffin. Bob Griffin from the chat, one of my subscribers, gets to be this, this lovely gentleman here. And uh, who else? Who else have we got? Uh, the newest subscriber, Ground Zero. Ground Zero. Ground Zero. <laughs> How do you spell it? Ground Zero. There you are. A E R O. Perfect. Perfect. <laughs> you guys are like me, me, pick me, pick me. Pick me, pick me. We'll get additional people we can name later, guys. Uh, I don't know if you guys want to actually be in the game because. Because, uh, I don't know if you guys know what usually happens to my, uh, my party members. Rename the Kestrel. The Kestrel. What is it? The... The Chilled Arachnid. The Chilled... There you go, you get to be the ship, man. Arachnid. Oh, the chill. it's just the Chilled Arak. Alright, it's the Chilled Arak. There we go. This is the name of our ship. The Chilled Arak. <laughs> Before Bob Griffin dies. Alright, alright, so I think we're good to go, guys. There's not too much I can do at this point. So I think we should probably just jump in, jump on in and start. There's the, there's the look of our ship, guys. So this is going to be badass. The data you carry is vital to the remaining Federation fleet. You'll need supplies for the journey, so make sure to explore each sector before moving on to the next. But get to the exit before the pursuing rebel fleet can, fleet can catch up. Tip, power bars, upgraded systems can be helpful. Even if you don't have enough reactor power to use them, they'll still absorb one damage. Alrighty, continue. Okay guys, here we are, here we are. In our first in our first area, we've got some uh, very light shielding it looks like. We've got two, two shield power there. Level two, one shield barrier. 
Uh, let's take, what do we got? We've got our ship options here. Our crew, Ziggy D, Bob Griffin, and Ground Zero, or Ground X. Equipment currently Artemis missiles and burst laser. Not too much to start off with, we just have to sort of keep going. So we have 16 fuel at the moment, we started with 16 fuel, 8 missiles, and 2 drone parts. And that's our current scrap metal, which is used to purchase things. And all systems are go! So basically we can be like, we probably want someone on engines. We want someone on, uh, someone on engines. Someone in the captain, is Ziggy in the captain? Good. Uh, Ground Zero is in, the, he's the gunnery sergeant, Ground Zero. Gunnery sergeant, Ground Zero. You're very happy with the placement of my face? Awesome. Alright guys, let's do it. Let's jump into this. There's not much to do in this first system, so we want to jump somewhere. So, looks like we're currently orbiting our current location. Let's jump into an unvisited location. What could be there? Oh, fuck, I'm nervous. I'm so nervous. Oh shit, <laughs> not a good start. Your arrival is greeted by numerous computer alerts. The nearby automated Rebel Scout has used a local satellite to deploy a virus to disrupt your shield system. Holy shit, hopefully it won't cause further problems before you can destroy it. <laughs> okay. <sighs> okay. <laughs> oh, oh, oh shit. <laughs> Ziggy, one thing that's new, underneath the crew they've added a button that saves your crew position and a button to send all crew back to safe location, it's really helpful. Uh, under your crew, save your current crew location. Alrighty, I'm uh... Oh, so I can have it be, so uh, battle stations, I can have a battle stations one. So my shields are currently disabled because of the virus, I think. Off shields down, unpowered, temporarily disabled by enemy or location. So there's not much I can do with that. Sorry, not much I can do with that. But I don't think I need someone in the captains. Uh, I don't need someone in the captains, do I, for uh, combat? Ziggy can kind of just go wherever he's needed. Gunnery is fine. I think engines is fine. It gives us some evasiveness, I believe, from memory. Uh, increases dodge chance. And uh, I don't think having having anyone here matters, does it? I don't think so. But Ziggy can Ziggy can chill here for now. The captain he's going to be commanding from the front. <laughs> In earlier sectors, you want to explore as much as you can of the left-hand side before going right Ziggy to maximize your early game upgrades. I think that was probably going to be the strategy I'd go for. But alright guys, let's do this. Let's target their weapons, I think. So I'm going to fire an Artemis, Artemis missile at their weapons, and a burst laser at their weapons as well. Let's do this. Combat ho! Let's do this, guys. Let's take down the drone. Pilot enables evasion. Oh, okay, my bad. Fire, guys! Fire! Oh, okay, hold on. Oh, it's okay. They're recharging. Oh shit! O2, Ziggy, <laughs> go put out the fires. <laughs> no. Uh, um. Shit. How do I? How do I do this again? <laughs> how do I? How do I airlock out the O2? Shit. Alright, put out the fires, bro. Put out the fires. Put out the fires. I think I've disabled their weapons. All right, I fucked them up, but we've, we've got a bit of drama here. <laughs> shit. <laughs> Leaving behind a collection of useful scrap material. I'm panicking, guys. I'm panicking. Alright, no need to save missiles? Okay, you're probably right. Ship explodes, leaving behind. I got some missiles back, it's okay. Come on guys, put out the fires. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> okay guys, repair, quick repair the oxygen. No! Open, open, balance out the oxygen. No, 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 get in the med bay! <laughs> fuck, fuck. Alright guys, let's open, we gotta balance out the oxygen. Please, uh, open, open all inside doors. Open all doors on the ship. Not the, it's not going to open all the, all the outside doors, is it? Okay, good. Oh, there we go. That's the balancing. Okay. <laughs> Alright, guys. Get in the med bay. Get healing, guys. Get healing. <sighs> Charge up the med bay. Oh, yeah, right. I need power. Alright. There we go. <laughs> okay. Power to the med bay. Power to the med bay. <laughs> I'm so panicking. I'm so panicking. Yeah, well, I think we're allowing some backseat gaming, guys, because I'm terrible. And uh, it'll help me learn. It'll help me learn. <laughs> Alright. Alright, Ziggy, get back in the captain's seat. This did not go well. This did not go well. I think I should probably start with doors closed, I guess. Let's close all doors on the ship. Alright, let's get back in the engine room. We're okay, guys. We're okay. <laughs> This ship's captain. Captain, we got a noob. <laughs> okay, uh, so, you can potentially upgrade things on your ship using scrap. We have 49 scrap. 
wondering how worth it is to uh, upgrade any of our current stuff. We have we're missing one power to like kind of power everything at once, but I don't think that's a big deal. I think I'll, I'll save it for now, and we'll jump to a new we'll jump to a new sector for now. All right, I think we're good. Let's let's disable the med bay, put them back in the engines, and uh. <sighs> okay, open all doors and turn off the oxygen. That sounds like a bad thing to do. Open, open all the doors. You guys, open all. The, I reckon open all the doors for flying around. Hold on, is it looks like my oxygen is still a bit low. Looks like my oxygen is still a bit low. Upgrade doors and sensors. So let's let's have a look. Doors allows remote door, remote opening, and closing of doors. Upgrades to blast doors impede fire spread and intrude to movement. Okay, and sensors reveals the interior of your ship and gives information about energy ship enemy ships. Ooh, the sensors could be handy. I think I'm gonna go for sensors and we'll save the rest. All right, so sensors have been upgraded. Hopefully that'll help out a bit. Upgrade doors. Everyone's like, upgrade the doors. <laughs> All right, let's go. Let's go exploring a little bit first. I don't want to go straight into the nebula. I don't think. Uh. Can I not jump this far? Oh, it's too far away, okay. We do have to jump into the nebula. I have an oxygen sensor in the top left. Yeah, oxygen's 100%. Okay, we're good. We're good. Okay, you arrived in the middle of a plasma storm. Despite the harsh conditions, a rebel scout seems to be waiting for you. Oh man, they're on the lookout for me. This guy looks pretty real. Okay, he's got one shield. A uh, bit, bit of hole energy there. Relationship hostile. We took some. We did take some hull damage previously in that last combat. Not too much though. All right, let's make some decisions here. Oh, the nebula is shutting down. We don't really know what's going on. So if something's set on fire in here, oh, has it also disabled our shields? Not enough power. Is the nebula like blocking some of our power or something? Iron storm. Oh shit. <laughs> this start is awful. <laughs> Iron storm. So I think this is like reduced our power and our sensors and everything. <laughs> Crap. <laughs> Missile the shield, laser the weapons. So missiles do cut through shields, yeah. Alright, so we'll start off, we will start off by missiling shields. And, uh... Not enough power to weapons. I only have enough for the Artemis missile at the moment, so I'm gonna have to reallocate after a bit of time there. He's got a drone? Shit! Alright, go, go missile, go missile. Come on, come on, come on. Charge up missile. Fuck. <laughs> Fuck! <laughs> okay, the missile's fired. I think I've disabled his shield, so I need to reallo reallocate. Oh no, we do have enough for the laser. Oh man, I'm an idiot. Okay, uh, go to weapons. And I, I kind of want to like missile the drones to get rid of the drones that are attacking me too. Fuck, maybe I should have ran away! <laughs> oh man. Repair, man, repair! <laughs> No, the O2's down, the O2's down. Uh, please don't kill us, we'll give you everything we have. Okay, I'm willing to accept your offer. Five fuel, uh, four missiles, and some scrap. I will accept their surrender. <laughs> okay, Jesus. Repair the oxygen, guys, we're running out of oxygen. Fast, guys, fast. Oh, the f no! There's a fire on board, there's a fire on board. Alright, I need to get into the medship. Disable weapons. Healing, healing, healing. Alright, come on, man, repair that oxygen. <laughs> repair that oxygen. Oh, fuck. No, no, okay, we're all good, we're all good. Alright, oxygen's starting to... Oxygen's starting to increase. <laughs> Alright, let's get repairing. Let's get repairing, guys. Let's get repairing. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> um, okay, I think we're okay. Oxygen is starting to flood again. I think we're feeling good. Alright, you, you get in there too. Finish the repairing. You go get healed, Ziggy. You guys are okay. Finish repairing. Alright, let's just do a ship check. Let's just do a ship check. Is everything okay? <laughs> Is everything okay? I think everything's okay, guys. I think we're okay. I think we've made it out of this somehow. Somehow made it out of this alive. Alright, <laughs> get back in. Bob Griffin and Ground Zero have switched roles, it seems, but that's okay. <sighs> <sighs> Okay, okay. 50% hull, second jump swag. <laughs> so I think you can only get repairs at like a, a station or something. So everyone's everyone's demanding I upgrade the doors. I think that might be a good idea. So that gives us blast doors. Uh, impede fire spread and intrude, intrude movement. 
Alright, let's upgrade the doors then. I'm like super low on power in here, huh? Alright, let's put the shields up and get ready to jump, guys. <sighs> Alright guys, I'm gonna run a quick ad break. I'll take an RQP and then we'll then we'll jump. It's not going well so far, guys. It's not it's not going well so far. <laughs> I'll keep the crew in the same roles, they'll stay more effective. Okay, good to know. That's good to know. Switch over, guys. Switch over. Oh, and the shields are up. The shields are up. <sighs> Alright, I think we need to I think we need to manage the shields a bit better. 